If you break the commandments of keeping your beard, go ahead. It shall teach men so by your actions. He shall be called the least in the kingdom of heaven. So let me ask you, you want to be in the kingdom of heaven? Yes or no? Yes or no? I don't want to hear about everybody. I want to hear about you, bro. You want to be in the kingdom of heaven? Yes. You can't get there. You know why? You ain't got your beard. You believe in God? You believe in God? Thank you. I'm a man of God. Do you believe in God? Yes, I'm believing. Do you believe in Christ? Oh, oh yes, yes, yes. You do anything that they say? I'll try. <laughs> yes or no? I'll try. Okay. Matthew 5, 17. You know, it's very hard. Yeah. Matthew 5, 17. Watch this. Okay, okay. I'll try. You know it's hard? Being poor. That's hard. It's not being poor, but we have to being try. Being poor is hard, bro. We have to try. Watch this. Matthew because chapter 5 and verse 17. This is what Jesus this is what Jesus the Christ said. Go ahead. Think not that I've come to destroy the law or the prophets. Where do you find the law and where do you find the prophets? Where do you find the law and where do you find the prophets? The law is in the book. Right, in the Old Testament. Go ahead. I, I am not come to destroy but to fulfill. What did Christ fulfill? Okay, he fulfilled the law of sacrifice when he killed himself for us. That's the law of sacrifice. That's what he fulfilled. Now, now, no, no, no. He fulfilled the law of sacrifice. He sacrificed his life for us so that we can gain access to God. You're not listening. You're not listening. He sacrificed himself. But why did he do it? You know that he did, but why did he do it? See, because this is the thing, like, because I'm noticing that you, that you, you have a lot to say, but you don't use your hearing to learn. You got it? Read. For verily I say unto you, till heaven and earth pass. You still got a heaven above your uh, above your head, and you still got earth with, uh, below your feet. Go ahead. One jot or one tittle shall in no wise pass. From the law right. to all be fulfilled. That's what the Bible says. Now hold on. This is what Jesus, Jesus said this. Right. Now you said out of your mouth. You said, no, no, no. You said you would do what Christ said. You would try. Okay. Are you going to try to grow a beard now? Yes, I'll try to grow my beard. But Listen, I'm, when I'm you say funny. yes and you're shaking your head no, yeah. that's not cool, bro. I didn't shake my head and say that. If I shake my head, everybody would say I'm going to do. No, no, no. You said I'm going to try. I said I'm going to try, but my head shake. Do, listen, say, sister. Okay. Um, do I love you? Yes. <laughs> Dallas, you know what I mean? That's it. No. <laughs> no. Read on. Watch this. Read on. Whosoever therefore shall break one of these least commandments, it's little for a man to grow a beard. It's little for a woman to get out of their pants and put on when, a skirt. You born, did you born with beard? That's the, that's the whole thing. Huh? It, because the thing is that as a man, it's a difference between the men and the women. A beard. You understand? Right now, right now, you look like a boy without your beard. Now you can't grow it. If you cannot grow it. When you baptize, it's a different story. You're born again, you become a Why? child. You're, you're Once a man and twice a child. You ever know about that? Okay, do you know you gotta keep a beard? Once as a man? Once a man. Well, when are you gonna start being a man and putting on a beard? Right. Child. Let's ask that question. Answer me that question. Answer me that question. When are you gonna start keeping a beard? Today? When it grow back. When it grow back? Yeah. So you're gonna come here next week and you have a beard on your face? I said when it grow back, it's gonna take time. He's now. I know, it usually time. takes about a week. It takes time. Okay, it usually takes about a week. Next week, you're gonna come back with a beard? I'm growing my beard, but it's gonna take time. I understand that. But are you going to grow it? You're gonna have five yes, o'clock yeah, yeah, that's, that's, that's all I wanna hear. I wanna hear yes. Yes, yes and no. Not, oh, you know, because I can That's what we do. As a people, we're ignorant like that. You understand? As men, we say yes. We say no. We don't say maybe. No. 
You just said no, no, no. But you, like, you know, I'm gonna try and get this. You know, because I don't know where to get the back again. No, 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 no. That's how we do. We we can't talk like that as men. You understand? Read it again. This is important, brother. Yeah, that's the reason why these other nations they don't take they don't take us serious because we have men who speak like that all the time. Oh, I didn't go to, I, I, I was late because I was, um, you know, because I was, like, you know, because I was, um, uh, you know, because I did this and I'm, uh, uh, huh? We don't, we got to speak serious, brother, okay? This is life and death. Right. That's right. Read. Whosoever therefore shall break one of these least commandments. If you show up to the most high with no beard, go ahead. And shall teach men so. You teach men with your actions. See, I right hear we all have our beards. You understand? We're showing the men that it's possible to grow a beard. If we decide, with fringes on, if we decide to shave off our beard, right. you're going to take my example and say, you know, well, the, that brother right there shaved off his beard. I have to do the same thing. You're going to follow my example, and it's wrong. Listen, read that again. Because how, all right, you follow God? You follow God? You follow God? When was the last time you saw him? When was the last time? When was the last time you saw him? When was the last time you saw God? So how, did you see him? You can't see God. So how can you follow him? God is a spirit. How can you follow God if you can't see him? I see God every day. You know how I see him? Do you know how I see him? I see him in this Bible when he talks to me. And I see that I have to keep it I have to keep the the beat matter of fact. Look uh Leviticus 19. Leviticus chapter 19 and 27. Let's read it again for the brother. Watch this. Nobody can see God. Leviticus chapter 19 and verse 27 Read You shall not round the corners of your head Neither shall thou mourn the corners of thy beard That's what God said Now why can we Why do we have to do that? Read the first verse Leviticus 19 and 1 And the Lord spake unto Moses saying Speak unto the congregation of the children of Israel. Why is he called children? Because children are supposed to follow the father. Right. right. And right now, all of us are acting like kids. You understand? That's why God told Moses, speak unto the children because we're kids. We want to do whatever the hell we want to do. We, we think whatever we think is correct. That's wrong. Right. Read. Speak unto the children, unto, speak unto all the congregation of the children of Israel, and say unto them, Ye shall be holy. You're supposed to be holy. For I, the Lord your God, am holy. For I, the Lord your God, am holy. How I'm rolling, you gotta be rolling. I got a beard, you gotta have a beard too. That's this right. is what God says. This is the reason why you as a man, as a follower, excuse me, as a, uh, how, did you tell, how did you say you, said you were? You were a follower of God? A son of God? What were you? You're a man of God. So as a man of God who follows God, you're supposed to have your beard if you follow God. That's right. You have to be holy just like God is holy. Right. Now, let's go back to Matthew 5. Whosoever therefore shall not shall break one of these least commandments if you break the commandments of keeping your beard go ahead and shall teach men so by your actions he shall be called the least in the kingdom of heaven so let me ask you you want to be in the kingdom of heaven yes or no yes or no i don't want to hear about everybody i want to hear about you bro you want to be in the kingdom of heaven yes you can't get there you know why you ain't got your beard I will get it, trust me. No, man. Well, oh, I hope so. I pray. I pray that you repent. Trust me, you will see. I pray. I don't trust in no man. I trust in this Bible, though. Right. And I pray that you, I pray that because a lot of people say, you don't trust me, man. I can do it. Don't worry, Bridget, man. I'm doing it, bro. Trust me. Okay. Read it again. Whosoever therefore shall break one of these least commandments. It's no different than the sister, too. The sister's got to be in a skirt. 
You understand? She believes in God. She knows Christ. But she has to keep these commandments. She ain't going to get the kingdom if she continues in her past. Read on. It shall teach men so, and if she teach women so, with her example, go ahead. He shall be called the least in the kingdom of heaven. The kingdom of heaven is great. There ain't nothing that's least in the kingdom of heaven. So if you're the least, you ain't in there because there's nothing least. Read on. But whosoever shall do and teach them, if you do the commandments and teach the commandments and with your example, okay, the same shall be called great in the kingdom of heaven. That's how you're going to get into the kingdom of heaven, by your example of keeping the commandments. That's right. You know, how old are you, if you don't mind me asking? Who, me? Yeah. I'm 40 years. How? 40 years. 48 years old. You know how there's a lot of brothers our age, right, that will put ink or tint in their hair because they don't want to have the grays. They don't want to see the gray. You know how old I am? Yeah, that's fine. I'm 42. Yeah. Yeah. But you know what? I'm not down with this world, bro. I'm not going to put no ink in my hair for what? God paint God right now is painting me this way. Right. That's right. And every day I change. And I'm going to keep how God, because God said that he does what? Everything perfect. Right. So According to God, I look perfect, bro. Mm, yeah, right. Yeah. I'm gonna keep this beard. I'm not gonna put no ink in my hair for what? This is how God is painting me right now as we speak. Okay. Good. Okay. I wish I was 14 with gray hair. Go ahead. You know? For I say unto you that except your righteousness shall exceed the righteousness of the scribe and Pharisees. Ye shall in no case enter the kingdom of heaven. You have to do the commandments. Because the Pharisees were teaching the commandments. They, so a lot of them weren't doing them. You have to learn these commandments, apply them to their life, and act upon them. Okay? In order for you to gain access to God's mercy. There's a lot of people who say, oh, I love God, I love Christ. Oh, I open my heart to you. Jesus! And then Shazam, they believe that they got powers and whatnot. They can walk on water. Nah, that's not happening, bro. You have to keep these commandments, get laughed at. Because people are going to point at you, your friends, and your, your so-called friends and your family. They're going to point at you and say, what is that? Ew, you, got, you look dirty with that beard. Ooh, what's the matter with you? What's some things hanging? Because you got to have fringes too. As a man of the Lord, how long have you been a man of the Lord? How long? How long? 20 years. 20 years and no fringes, bro? No beard on your face? Or well, you had a beard? Right, exactly. That's what I'm, that's the point I'm trying to get to. Yeah, well now this it's grow it again. I'm gonna grow it again. Yeah, man, because it's it's cool to have a beard. It's also lawful. Alright. We used to scream black power while hair rum was pushed. But at the end of the day, nothing's in vain. IUIC has been given a vision. The tents of Judah has risen. Many has attempted the mission. Minor murmuring, omitting, and missing the mark. Just reading that he had the flame of fire in his eyes gave us the spark. We on Paul's mission. We out on the road, purple and gold. From Mexico, Cuba, Haiti, Ghana, Sierra Leone. 144,000 boots banging, concrete crackling These are how our men repented at heart The scriptures is proof IUIC, we deliver the truth